My name is Terry Moore. I wrote the book The Watchers. The Watchers. And I wrote the book to protect the horseshoe crabs, to encourage children, citizens, people in the United States to take action to do something about it to protect the horseshoe crabs because they're all part of an ecological system. A system of uh, food chains and webs where if we eliminate one creature from the system, we uh, seriously create an ecological imbalance to the whole system. A close friend of mine when I was a kid took me to a bay, not unlike this, um, where they were spawning. It was a moonlit night, and I never forgot it. And it sort of became part of my book. What you're looking at it is this Barnegat Lighthouse, also affectionately known as Barney. And probably Barney's guiding light made me think about the Jersey Shore. Um, and that became my place. Another part of the Jersey Shore are the creatures, the wildlife, the strange, magical, mystical uh, creatures along, some alive, like seagulls over our heads or the relics left of the dead creatures, like the horseshoe crab, the most mystical and ancient of all our sea creatures that have been here for millions of years before the dinosaur age. They're both frightening, gentle, mysterious, beautiful, and so helpful to all of us, and in danger. Ancient, wonderful, um, helmet-like crab, eyes all over the top, eyes, two eyes at the top, two eyes at the side, two eyes in its tail, a sensor tail, tells it when it's supposed to come in um, to spawn by the full moon. And tonight's the night of the full moon. Kids leading the way. In the dark of the night, the moonlit bright, crabs are attacked in the bay. Sticks slice down, dead shells abound. There's no one to keep them at bay. The watchers, the watchers, watching night and day. The watchers, the watchers, the watchers watch and stay. Three lonely kids leading the way. The story of the watchers is a story of Timmy, the main character takes a journey from innocence to knowledge to action. She's an optimistic, caring child who wants to do well. And along with her sidekick, Sataki, they take the journey together to save the environment. They save the environment by helping the horseshoe crabs. Along the way, they meet Brian. Brian, who's careful, interesting, studious, quiet who has his own secret, he, with a number of other children, protect the horseshoe crabs. Timmy and Sadaki meet them and join the club, the group, to watch over the horseshoe crabs from another group of children who are more vicious and angry and are trying to destroy the horseshoe crabs, as is some fishers and uh, harvest uh, people who harvest the crabs, so they're trying to protect the horseshoe crab but Rebecca's gang is trying to do that for their own secretive reasons, for their own reasons that's only known to you, the reader. The two groups clash, leading to an ultimate confrontation. Before that happens, Timmy does the unthinkable thing to protect the horseshoe crabs. You, the reader, learn about the beauty of the Jersey Shore, the importance of the horseshoe crab, not only to the environment, to, but to our lives, and how important it is to take action, to do something you believe in, and stand up for what you believe in.
what is the danger? What's the problem with the horseshoe crabs? Well, they're over harvested. Too many fisher people or, or companies capture the crabs, horseshoe crabs, and they crush them for fertilizer. Or they they use them for bait, um, often sold to other countries. And uh, if they're too much of them are captured, we no longer have the incredible horseshoe crabs who are an important part of the ecology. But many birds, uh, again, most important are the red knot, rely on these eggs. Without these eggs, they have no fuel, which means they have no food, and they can't continue their journey and they'll die. So the laws are important. Laws are created by people, pressured by people. Uh, uh, bills are created by politicians, supported by people, they become laws. And the laws in New Jersey now say that uh, we are not allowed to over harvest uh, horseshoe crabs. Um, in other states, that's not so. Uh, so um, I hope you read the book. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you appreciate the journey to me and Brian and Sadaki go through. And it encourages you, it encourages you to the reader, um, the person to take action um, to protect the environment. No one cares to watch and protect The chain will eventually break more. The watchers, the watchers